Holy shit. Is that already the ace? Is he alive? Is that him? Is that really him? What's up, guys? What's up? It's a Lego stream. For the first time I've Look at me! I look all fly. I don't have the- I don't have- Okay, I should probably not hit that because, you know, I'm gonna be honest, my stream is real- real jank. Uh... Oh, okay. No, sorry, I thought the webcam was moving. NVIDIA Broadcast has a feature where it auto frames you, so if I move here, boom, look at that. Oh, look at that, I can move around now. Anyway, my, my setup's real jank, but it also looks real nice. My chair that I normally sit on, I'm not sitting on it right now, I'm sitting in a bed, you'll see why in a sec. My microphone stand is leaning on that so that it gets to my face so that you guys can actually hear me. Um, which I just had to check that you could actually hear me. Okay, you can. The levels are going up, which means you can. Good. Cool. Um, I need water. I'm gonna be honest, I didn't have a stream planned for today, but then, but then, this happened. Isn't that cool? Two, two cam- Two cameras, one of them, which isn't working. Hang on. Um, uh, it's fine, it's fine. Alright, give me a second. I swear, this was fine like two seconds ago, I swear. Ari's actually three foot, if that's a lie, that's a lie. I'm gonna switch this to full cam. Look, this was working two seconds ago, I swear to god. <laughs> Always fails on me when I need it. Alright, that's why, it just crashed, that's fine. We can fix that. Start. Boom. I think we're good. Yeah, we're good. We're good. Now you can see it. Boom. Two cameras. Two cameras. I never had that before. I had this one webcam. Now I'm using my phone as another webcam. Isn't that awesome? We're gonna hope it doesn't crash, but look, we're building the Statue of Liberty in Lego. I should probably turn this light on. Because it's a little dark for you guys. See, what sucks? There we go. What sucks is lighting. Lighting sucks. Lighting sucks. Oh, you can see my leg. Isn't that nice? Nice leg. Lighting sucks. It's one of the worst things. Can you, can you, like, now you can see this, you can't see me. That's great. I hate it. It, it. It's so angering. It angers me. I look like I'm- I'm- I have no lights. Give me a sec. Oh. <sighs> Oh my god, <laughs> I don't have the energy. This stream started real high energy, and I don't have the energy to spare for it, I'm gonna be honest. Ugh, you can see my legs. There we go. A little, little better, a little, little better, a little, little better. <sighs> I started this with way too much energy, I'm so tired. <laughs> I actually haven't been streaming I've been really bad at, at streaming for the past few weeks because a little better? Yeah, hang on. We're gonna open this again and hope it's a little... There we go. Okay, we're gonna open that. We're gonna hope that this is okay. That webcam's a little low, isn't it? Better? That's better. Nice music too? Yeah, it's it's uh, stream beats as I always use. It's very nice. Um. So yeah, okay, anyway. Stream has been a little wonky. This past week's been so stressful for me. So I thought what better way to chill out Than play with a little bit of Lego. So we're gonna do some Lego. Uh, it's gonna be chill. It's gonna be it's gonna be fun But I haven't done a just Chang stream too much um, On in my YouTube in my not YouTube twitch career. How do I open this? Uh, there's tape here. I assume I gotta break that. Uh, so I haven't done just Chang too much I've done like one just Chang stream where I was playing playing math i was doing math homework um so this is a little more fun than that just trying is a way to get more followers maybe maybe but yeah i mean if you guys enjoy this you should uh tell a friend like yo ari's building some legos on stream you should go check him out is the music too loud by the way let me know because the levels are <laughs> this is difficult the levels look fine, but I just want to make sure. It's pretty good? Sick. Thank you, bro. <laughs> I cannot break this. Look at this. Oh, right there. I don't know if you can see that. It's a little dark, but... Oh. 
We're so close. <laughs> We're so close. I don't need scissors. I'm a manly man. <laughs> That's such a lie. All right, there we go. That's one. Now for the second one. I just gotta break the tape enough to get the tape off. Anyway, yo, if you didn't know, Jazz and I met up IRL uh, on Friday. It's Monday right now. I don't have school today um, or tomorrow because are you embarrassing yourself? No, this is great. Uh, I don't have school today or tomorrow because of Memorial Day, and then um, we have we had one snow day that we didn't use, so they're like, all right, we'll just put it on Tuesday. So, oh, hang on, let's, let's, oh, hell yeah, hell yeah. By the way, not sponsored. I bought this, bought this myself. Use scissors. I don't need to. I'm built different. All right. What's up, Ellie? Welcome, dude. Um, I haven't built Lego in a long time. <laughs> it doesn't let you say I nutted. Great. <laughs> nutted is now a permitted term in my stream. Um, naturally. Anyway, I haven't built this in a long time. Any anything relating to Lego, but what I'm seeing here is uh, bags that are numbered. So this one says one. So I assume this is the first one. Yeah, Lego would not sponsor me, but if you if you think I'm a big streamer who got sponsored by Lego, I didn't. I bought it myself. This is all my own stuff. Can you guys hear the Lego stuff? Because I hope you can. That'd be great. Ugh, sorry, just looking for the book booklet. There we go. Book, nice, nice little book. It it looks nice, just like any Lego book does. Um, there's a there's a nice little quote on it. Uh, thou warden of the western gate above Manhattan Bay, the fogs of doubt that hide thy face are driven clean away. Thine eyes at least at last look far and clear. Thou liftest high thy hand to spread the light of liberty worldwide for every land. What fucking pussy shit? <laughs> what a shit quote. As if, as if the Statue of Liberty means that much. I'm gonna be honest. I was looking for so long, like, what what good Lego set would be fun to build on stream, would be fun for me to play with, and then, this was the only one I could find that was like, it's like 1600 pieces or something crazy like that, um, and it, it was, it would ship in one day, so I was like, alright, cool, I'll just buy this one, and, um, I was just like, this is gonna be terrible because America's not been doing great for the past year. I mean, it's not been doing great for a while, but the past year really highlighted just uh, how bad we can be. So I was like, is it is it is it political to buy the Statue of Liberty Lego set and do it on stream? And I was just like, you know what? Fuck it, let's just do it. Anyway, I'm just looking through here. Okay, so first of all, they have this. Ah, uh, fuck. They have they have this piece. That thing does jack shit. It doesn't do anything. Posture check? Alright, posture is check. I love this auto framing thing. It's real nice. I should put it on my normal streams. I just put it for this one, because if I didn't put it, I would be super far back for you guys. So it just focuses on me a little bit. Although, again, it's it feels low. Because I'm used to my head being like up here, when obviously you want it to be centered. I just am weird like that. Um, Why didn't you get this one? I, I can't click on it. <laughs> I'm not close enough to my computer. Uh, what, 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 what is it? If it's some made thing, I'm gonna kill you. But yeah, okay, so it tells you what each box gives you, like, how, <laughs> wow, I'm, I'm real good at this. How far along each number gets you, so that's, that's pretty cool. So we're gonna start with number one. I'm just gonna leave it to the side, because you guys don't even see it. Oh, wow, it really just, it just goes. It's a dollhouse, of course it is. Let's just start with, no with box one. Oh, by the way, uh, not, again, not sponsored, but this table was made by my cousin. I don't know if she's my cousin. Indians have very big families, and, um, so because of all that, like, you don't know if someone's your cousin or aunt or Masi or whatever. I think she's my Masi. We call her sister, which is a word for cousin, um, colloquially, I guess. So she made this. It's pretty cool. Uh, I think her Instagram is befitting gifts. So, yeah, if you want to check that out, she's pretty chill. Uh, this is, it just, it's amazing. Uh, this auto frame is working to me. I feel like your cam is about to fall each time. Yeah, right? It's, it, it's not normal, but it's pretty cool. And it's, it's nice considering I'm so far away from my webcam, like, physically. Um, it's like a robot, dude. It's like, a, it's like, it's like fucking dummy from Iron Man. I've been watching so many Marvel movies lately. Um... 
And Dummy shows up in like all the Iron Man movies. I'm pretty sure he died in the last one. And <laughs> oh god, dude, I had to cover. I literally put on socks. I just showed my knees. I just put on socks so that I wouldn't show feet. <laughs> that's that's like the only reason because you y'all are weird about that stuff. Um, in Indian culture, feet are kind of respected, so I'm not used to it. But um, yeah, <laughs> y'all are fucking weird about that shit. All right, what do we gotta do first? The first one has got eight eight things. So it's this one. Doom, 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 boom. That's the first. We've we've completed the first step already. Look at us rushing through this shit. Um, oh boy. Now it's for the now for the hard part. <laughs> now for the hard part is these pieces. It doesn't really tell you how long they are. It just tells you to pick them, which makes this much much harder. Much 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 harder. I also am not doing this as nicely as I know I could. Uh, one sixteen hundredth of the way there, basically. Um, I'm, I know I'm not doing this as nice as I could, like, I'm not separating everything correctly and all that good stuff. Uh, like, a lot of people color code it and stuff. I don't because, uh, I'm lazy. <laughs> I'm not about to do all that. But, um, it's definitely gonna be the reason I slow down. Where the freaking heck? I need pieces that are like this, like, flat pieces, according to this, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's what it's asking for. So where is it? Where are you? Uh, there's one, but I don't think it's supposed to have any labels on it. It didn't say, like, hey, have, have Statue of Liberty written on it. So that's nice. Is it in one of these bags that I just threw away? No. 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 This is a good start. I <laughs> this is a real good start. Um, this is the fucking piece that doesn't do anything this thing sucks um the sun the sun loves to shine through right when i'm streaming which is really nice because i get super hot and i don't have my fan there we go fan hello thank you that feeling when you say hello to a fan i mean you guys are my fans right Fucking stupid. All right. Anyway, where the fuck? Okay. You know what? You know what? Fine. I'll stop being a little bitch. I'll color code everything. But it's okay. It shows black pieces right there, right? You you guys can see that right there. Those two those two black pieces right there. Oh, my phone's making a shadow. That's real nice. So whenever I show something to the phone, it's a it's a, it's a phone. Right? Uh, what he did say. Hello? Addict? What does that mean? <laughs> Don't know what that means. Fuck. <laughs> what the fuck? How? Did I manage to drop pieces? I didn't think so. How? <laughs> like I said, I haven't done Legos in so long. And the last Lego I did was this car. And the car, um, it just doesn't, it, like, when you try to open the doors, it just shatters it's like what is what are you trying to do hang on let me just i just realized i have some stuff open on my computer that is unneeded but uh there we go yes it's uh not pornography sorry the way i said it like oh it's unneeded it just seemed like i was talking about porn i just needed to make it clear that I wasn't <laughs> just needed to make that make you guys aware of that where the fuck are these pieces There's no way they're in box two. Oh my god, there's multiple box two, which means there's probably multiple box ones, aren't there? I don't think anyone assumed that, but now that you bring it up, yeah. Alright, this is five and three. Four and five. Did it, I did it, it's one, this is one. See, I thought there would be one box one. For some reason, they split it into two, because fuck me, I guess. Um, I can't hear anything. There's no headphones, but thighs. Yes, what's up? I have, I have, you know, I've been, I've been doing those gym workouts, unlike everybody else. Also, no, I haven't. I've never done a gym workout in my life. Sorry, Miss R. I know you're putting some effort in, 
you're a good gym teacher, I'm not gonna do it, regardless of how fun you make it. Anyway, we got, we got the pieces we need now. I'm so angry. Why would they split them into two bags? Why do they hate me? But anyway, uh, we're gonna we're gonna try to split these into two sections so that hopefully maybe that'll make it easier for me in the future. I have no idea. But uh, I also don't know if dumping everything out is a good idea. But I did it, so uh, that's gonna bite me in the back in the future. <laughs> Let's see what happens. Oh boy! Real reckless with these Legos, man. I, I'm a real bad boy. <laughs> I'm a real bad boy. Um. Anyway, uh, let me know if the audio is good. Uh, just I know you said it was earlier, but if anything breaks, just let me know. Just because I don't have headphones in, I can't even like force myself to hear myself or anything like that. Clearly, don't have headphones in. My ears are open for the world to see. So um. Okay, so these are all the pieces that are like that are flat that I would need. There's only two sizes from the looks of it, so I assume just one big, one small is is easy. There's no medium. So we need one small and one... Wait, are they all the same size? They look like it. They do, okay. Um, we wanna put it like, like, like that, and like that, okay. Again, this lighting is really screwing with with the exposure for you guys. Let me see if I can just do it like... Okay, actually that looks kind of nice. I got it perfectly so a little bit of light comes through, just enough to make me not look completely dark, but not that bright either. I could get another light, but I feel like that's just too much work. Like, when have I put in that much work into my stream before? I say after putting a bunch of work into this setup, I'm real glad I closed the windows because this is also really hot right now. It was sitting right in the window, so I'm gonna just put it there. Um, we're gonna move this lamp over. Better brighting? A little bit better, maybe? Great. <laughs> Damn it! God, I hate lighting. It's like... It's what lighting and audio are the two biggest problems with streams. They're the two hardest things to figure out. Um, all right, you already see my legs, so I'm gonna just let you see the full leg so you can get this in the center. Uh, there we go. There you go. I think that's pretty good. You get you get a nice view of everything happening here. Um, okay, anyway. We got two steps done, finally. It took a while. Man, I look real dark. I did all this work so you would get my webcam and this thing. I could have just made this webcam go down here and it would have been so much easier. Uh, but I did all this work and now the lighting is what's gonna be this, the end of me. I could turn up the exposure on broadcast. Give me a second. I just want this to look nice. You know what I mean? We're gonna. This is gonna be our last attempt, otherwise uh, I screw me, I guess. I also just realized I didn't turn down the white balance. Um, so I'll do that real quick. White balance is something that a lot of streamers forget to change. But if you don't, you- there you go. Oh god, that's too bright. There we go. I think that's much better. White balance is something that a lot of streamers don't think about. But if you have noticed, I always change it because if I smile, uh, and I'm close to the camera, and the white balance is up, then my teeth look insanely yellow, like British yellow. You know what I mean? <laughs> uh, anyway. Okay. Okay, okay. So, now we need a big piece like this. I assume all of these ones are like the same size. They look it. Yeah, that's nice. Uh, and then we're gonna- Now we get the Statue of Liberty sign, which is right here. We are gonna put it- So, this goes here. And then this goes here. So we're making the base of the, the statue right now. British yellow? Yeah, like British British teeth, you know? The, the classic joke that British people have yellow teeth. Um, <laughs> I started watching Ant-Man just now. Like I said, I've been watching a lot of Marvel movies. I've been re-watching all of them, because um, I missed so much the first time around. I should probably do this in the, in the camera, right? Uh, I, I missed so many... Um, 
little references and and things and and characters recurring characters in the first go around of the Marvel movies. So I've been rewatching them, and they are they it's super fun, man. I I think the storytelling isn't perfect. I get why people shit on Marvel a lot, and honestly, I I do too. But I think it's it's smart because it's good for the whole family. Like, sure, the storytelling can be really simple sometimes, but that means that you can watch it with kids.、Um, Which is why Deadpool is probably not gonna stay R-rated for long. I don't. I mean, I have no, I have no clue what's gonna happen. But I would not be surprised if they kind of stopped with the gruesome stuff with Deadpool if he starts getting merged into the MCU. Um, which would suck because I really love、uh, his story. But sometimes these things happen. <laughs> sometimes they kind of just end up doing.、Uh, Doing stuff like that so that you know they can make more money, which is fair, I suppose. I mean, that's the whole reason they make those movies is to make money. But you know, I I I, I think like a lot of other people, I hope that、uh, Deadpool stays not PG or not PG thirteen, R rated. This is a this is a pretty small base from what I'm seeing so far. What we're doing, this is not huge, which is cool.、Um, but I I mean I assume it's gonna go super high, which is gonna be the main thing. They're gonna make it a super tall building. I dude, I haven't played with Legos in in a decent amount of time, and I miss it. This feels so nice. It's so easy. It's just like、uh, I don't know. It's got that feel to it, like like when you're playing Minecraft, and they're like they tell you how to make things, you know, um, like when when they when you're like looking at a redstone contra- contraption, you're building it along with the video, and it's like, oh, okay, I'm understanding how this works. I'm understanding what you're telling me to do. That's always nice. I actually follow this dude on TikTok who um is a master builder, as in like I think recruited or hired by Lego to build for them. Uh, and that dude makes a lot of cool stuff. I'm I sadly I don't know the dude's name, uh, username on TikTok right now, so I can't give him like a shout out. But the dude's way bigger than me in followers anyway, so you know, no worries on that end. But yeah, I don't know. It's it's crazy. It's such a creative、uh, community and just idea to like let kids have these building blocks to build and like. Making it accessible for adults too—it's really smart. Good business practice and just fun in general.、Um, this is simple. It's just finishing off the base. What's nice is that right now it's a very uniform, uniform、um, structure, so I don't have to look too closely at the booklet. Eventually, I will, because、uh, I'll get stressed out and be like, "Oh, I'm gonna mess this up!" Oh no! But for now, we're doing pretty well. Um. All right. How are we gonna do this next part? A small one on the left and a small one halfway across. Okay. Now it's again very even. Now we're just clearing off the finish for this. But yeah, how how have your we- weekends been? Cause I I think Monday's a holiday for everyone, right? Memorial Day.、Uh, at least every American. I don't know how it is、uh, everywhere, but how have your weekends been? Ah, shit. <laughs> I've I've、uh, been relaxing a lot for the past、uh, couple days. <sighs> I I've been super stressed. So like I said earlier, I don't know why. It's been like insane. So that's why I've been a little off stream. I haven't been editing. Um, but I definitely want to get back into editing. I was gonna talk about this earlier, dude. Da- if DaVinci Resolve makes a mobile app that also cloud saves to the PC app. Uh, DaVinci Resolve being my editing software, I would lose my mind. That would be incredible. I would love that. They've got to do that, man. I don't know how. It would take a lot of work, but it would. Ah,、oh, I'd pay so much for that. Being able to work off like off the computer. I don't know. I like being able to do stuff in car rides. Like car rides. You're not really doing much if you're not driving, obviously. And I don't like to drive, so you're not doing much. Why not get some editing or something done? All right, 
the next pieces we need are, are a little bit harder to find. Um, I don't know exactly what color. I think it's these colored pieces. So we're gonna look for all the ones with this. Uh, let me just put this down somewhere. Move all these over. This is a real wobbly table because my uh, my floor is not level, but it's fine. It works fine. It's a real nice table though. I I've been because what's nice is you can lift this thing up, so I can just like use it as a tray whenever I want to. I um, have a bad habit of just eating stuff in my bed now because of this thing. Um. You know what? Before I keep searching, I'm gonna make sure there's not another one bag, you know what I mean? If there's another bag labeled one, I'm gonna lose my mind. Uh, five, two, three... Alright. The twos... The twos we're putting over there... Oh, I do have these two bags left. These... These two bags were in the one bag, so I'm gonna leave them there. Two bags go there. bags okay so there's two bags for each number for some reason so um yeah see this this is the bag that has some of the pieces I need it looks like um let's see if we can just open this up and not spill everything everywhere and see if we can just grab what we need which are these itty bitty pieces, if you can see that right there, yeah, real nice. Uh, we need eight of them. I assume there's only eight in here from the looks of things. So, or maybe, you know, nine. They do give extras sometimes, which is nice. I've been collecting all the extras and I just have them in a little bag. Uh, not little bag, it's actually a pretty big bag, but I one day want to make my own Lego thing, but I don't have the pieces for it, you know what I mean? I don't have nearly enough pieces for it. Okay, so that's eight of those pieces. And we need some from here too, I think. Yeah, see for this one, for these colored um, finishes, there's three different sizes. So there's a medium, so we need four medium. I'm gonna just throw all them in the middle so that we know what we need. There we go. You know what, maybe throwing it in the middle isn't great because this isn't a level surface, it's a little bit higher. Um, but we'll leave them over here, so. We've got uh, these eight, we've got two of these medium pieces we need four, so all four of these. We need four of these, okay, so it's just these four, and then four of the really small ones which we can find in here. Um, right there, one. And the two. Counting with RDAs. Uh, three, and bow. Okay. Lego's easy, man. Kids can do this. Oh, wait, they do. That's what they're made for. Um, we're doing it along the edge of this, so we're gonna do... I'm really sad that I can't hear the lofi. Lofa? Lofa? I think it's lofi. I'm really sad I can't hear the lofi, but... Um, I sadly do not have headphones, so this is something only you guys get to enjoy. <laughs> so I hope you're enjoying it, because it's it's pretty nice music. Harris Heller popped off with this uh, playlist specifically. I like all of them. I play a lot of different stream beat songs, but this one specifically just has a vibe to it that people really like. Um, alright, and then we do the medium pieces around- oh shit, okay, so it's different for each side. Let's do the long pieces first, which go here. Um, like that. This is starting to look like a base. Okay, I get long piece here. And here. Then if we're facing this direction, the smaller pieces go on the outsides, which are here. I love this- I love when, um, Legos end up smooth like this. You know, they don't have the little bumps, they just- they, they're perfect, you know? 
I love when everything fits into place perfectly so that it's like all smooth. That's like the highlight of making Legos. Do you guys in the chat actually play with Legos? I'm, 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 I mean, I feel like it's kind of expensive. It's kind of an expensive toy to play with, but it's pretty nice, you know? Alright, now we need yellow pieces, it looks like, which is, they're like, I mean, I assume these are more beige than yellow. I mean, if you look at that right there. They look kind of yellow, but they're not as yellow as this. So I assume they're just these normal beige ones. But I'm just gonna scroll ahead. Yeah, yep. I, I scrolled ahead to look for when these pieces come into play and these are way brighter in the booklet. Sometimes the booklet coloring is off, which sucks because it makes it a little bit more difficult for me. Especially because I just suck at like colors. <laughs> Whenever I played Among Us, I don't know if I was just always distracted, but I could never remember the colors of people that walked by me. Uh, and I would refuse to look at the names, I always looked at the colors, so I'd end up getting confused every time. Somehow still won a lot of games whenever we still played that a lot. I really want to get back into that game, it's such a fun game. I'm sad it kind of died off so quick with my friend group, because um, it's genuinely like... It, it's just so simple to play, and considering it's free on mobile, you know, and so cheap on PC, it, it's just accessible. That's what a game needs, is accessibility to everybody. If your game's accessible, it's probably, like, gonna do pretty well. Or at least, like, if it's well made, the, the community that you- Wow, I said that weird. The community that you make will at least enjoy it. Even if it doesn't blow up, like Among Us did, people will still enjoy it. You know? Like, I played Outriders. That was a good game. It wasn't bad, but- I, I don't know, I think that since it was so, it was like a shooter, and um, people just didn't like it, I think, as compared to like, games like Among Us. Which, you know, maybe they're not comparable. Did I do this wrong? Yeah, I did. I don't know if it matters, uh, but it matters to me, so I'm gonna fix it. How do we do this? There we go. Alright, the piece is coming in handy for once. Alright, I may have shit talked to you, but that was actually pretty helpful. <laughs> I, I just shit talked this dude and then used him, so. Um, that's me. That's just how I do. That's just how I roll. But, yeah. It, this doesn't really matter, the thing I just fixed. Like, I doubt it'll even come into play. Um, because at the end of the day, this whole thing will be ridged in, in these, uh, bumps. Um... But, I don't know, I just wanted it to be perfect. <laughs> I'm a bit of a perfectionist. Which is great, because I'm also lazy. <laughs> so it's like, great, you're, the, the few things you make will be perfect, but you won't make them often, and you won't want to. That's nice, I like this. I'm having fun with this. I don't know how much we're gonna get through. I could do this again if you guys want. So let me know on Twitter, let me know on Discord, exclamation point Twitter, exclamation point Discord in the chat. Um, if you want me to do this more, if you want to see this on my YouTube, I can clip some of the funny stuff and keep it. It's up to you. Statue of Liberty is a narc. She's wearing a wire. Yeah, I, that's what I was like. I don't know if it's worth you buying the Statue of Liberty of all things, but I did it. Uh, and also welcome to the chat. Nice to see you. Um, all right. 12, 12 bitties and 16 other little bitties. These are some of the ones we need, these little brick things. They, they actually look like proper bricks, which is nice. Does this want to focus? It doesn't. Cool. It's just going to focus on my hand. Wait, can I do the- can I do the- hang on. I want to do the beauty thing. I want to do the, the beauty guru thing. What do they do? They do it like that. And they're like, whoa, check this out. Or like, whoa, isn't that cool? Focusing. It didn't focus, but it's cool. <laughs> I don't know if it's just not focusing because of broadcast? Although, I don't know why it would do that anyway. Ah, weird. Again, this is- I literally set this up, like, right before stream. I was just like- Because I tweeted out, like, yo, you know, we're gonna- we're gonna do, uh, a uh, LEGO building stream as soon as the LEGO thing comes in. And then I was too lazy to set up this camera that I'm using to- to show the LEGO. So then I was like, okay, I gotta- I see it come in- in the fucking mail, and I was like, okay, fuck, I gotta- I gotta run. I gotta get this ready. But, um... Hey, we got there, and it's, it's looking pretty good. 
Uh, I think I need these bits, yeah. I need 12 of these guys. Learning to count while also talking. This is a major skill that I used to not have, actually. I used to... If you didn't know, I actually had a lot of, like, a lot of videos up on YouTube uh, when I was younger. I would post videos, like, every day, and they'd all be, like, not edited or not edited well. Um, but it helped me edit a little bit more because I, I learned to do it a little faster. But, um, that experience, in that experience, I, I, I would do a lot of, like, Minecraft mining things. And I'm very... I'm very precise when I mine, um, I like to, um, whenever I'm mining, I like to do that thing where you like mine 11 blocks and then place a torch, mine 11 more, place a torch so that everything's lit perfectly. So whenever I'd mine while, while <laughs> recording, I would almost never, uh, talk. And I think I've started to get a little bit better about doing that. Because no one wants to sit here watching a dude count Legos and saying nothing. <laughs> but, yeah. Am I doing this right? I am. It looks right so far. Well, hang on now. Where am I wrong? Oh, yeah, that's where I'm wrong. I did this one off from where it's supposed to be. They are supposed to be on the beige, not on the gray. Yeah, that's what I did wrong. I was like, uh huh, the spacing does not look correct, but it's because I was being an idiot. It's okay, it's an easy fix. We don't need the, the stupid tool that I just roasted and then used. We don't need them. Uh, I just put this off as well. Ah, oh, I'm great at this. I'm great at Legos. Maybe I'll do more Lego streams though. I, I actually, um, when I was searching for Legos to buy, I wanted to buy, um, the Helicarrier from Marvel, and I also wanted to buy this ship in a bottle that looked really cool. So the Helicarrier was a much bigger one, the ship in the bottle was kind of a uh, smaller one. Um, but I ended up not doing either just because they wouldn't get delivered until either Tuesday or Thursday, which is like after my break ends, and it's like there's no point after that, like I don't know if I'll have time. So I ended up not buying those, but I mean I could always buy them again like later down the line which means that i could totally do another lego stream or another set of lego streams where i finish all those off which would be a lot of fun because i really do like doing this it's very chill i don't i don't feel like i have to be super over excited like i do with video games i can just kind of chill here which is a, a nice vibe um did i did I miss one? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay, so this one wasn't needed. It was just either a miscount or on the side for no reason. And then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Yeah, so that's 16 of the bricks. So that is this part, this step done. Next we need, next, next, next. We need um, these two. And finally, we can have the nice yellow improvement i am improving it's great we love to see improvement we stand <laughs> it's also nice because for this one specifically it's very uniform like i was saying earlier it just feels satisfying you do it and you're like yeah look at me look at me i'm building isn't that crazy yeah. Oh, sorry, I also didn't see it earlier. I don't have my headphones in, so I don't hear it, but and Pleb, thank you for the follow. Um, my bad. I always feel bad when I miss those, but <laughs> for once, I don't have my headphones in, so I just don't hear it, sadly. Ah, oh, man. This water bottle is so nice. Are water bottles things, things you guys think about, or do you just have some, and you're like, okay, I'll deal with it, or like, oh, it's, it's fine for me? Because... I have like a bunch in my house. We have a bunch of really old ones and all of them piss me off. <laughs> like all of them are in some shape annoying to me. And then I found this one and it was, it just worked. I don't know why. They just all had some small thing that pissed me off. Um, but when these Legos came in, so did um, a new water bottle. Cause this is 
one that I stole from my dad. <laughs> but I don't know, is that, is that weird? Do people care about water bottles or do you guys just kind of drink your water, <laughs> you know, without bitching about it like me? Because <laughs> I bitch <laughs> a lot about that stuff. I don't know why. I mean, so, uh, there's, there's, hang on, there's a lot of, I gotta actually count this for once. There's six long, which means six long here, which means there. Perfect. We, we did it. Um, then it goes right over here. Look at that. Look at that. I don't know what it's supposed to be or mean, but I did it. So everyone clap for me, please. I hope in the, in the, in the silence of your houses, you're clapping for Ari the Ace right now. And if your parents ask, you can be like, Oh yeah, this, this scrawny 17-year-old Indian boy asked me to clap, so I clap. And she's like, oh, so can he hear you? And you're like, no, I just clapped to him. So that he would sense my auras. <laughs> he would know. He's just built like that. He's just built different. Ellie tweeted a built different earlier. So it's canon now. We're built different. You know what's funny is- Oh, oh Hi! <laughs> Sorry, I wasn't looking at chat. What's up, Neeks? I assume that's how you say it? It's okay, I yell during MCCs. Yeah, MCC happened uh, yesterday, right? Or- I, I don't actually watch it, I just get a lot of it on my uh, timeline. When did it happen? I know it happened like very recently. But time has been a little weird for me. Um... I've been asleep at weird times, so I actually don't remember. Yep, it's Neeks. Sick. Welcome. Uh, they happen on Saturdays. Okay, yeah, so... Um, I, I heard a little bit about it. I heard that there's some drama with it. Uh, but... I hope you enjoyed it. I, I normally don't yell, ever. Especially for, like... Like, my dad loves to yell at, like, football and stuff. Um, but when I'm watching tournaments and stuff, I never yell, ever. I'm very calm. But, man, I missed a tournament yesterday I wanted to watch with Psycraft. Uh, Mango tweeted about it. It was like Mango, Helga, I think Panic, and someone else who I haven't met before. But um, they were doing a Clash of the Creators thing, I guess. And they were like fighting to uh, be the first to beat the Wither or whatever. And I was out for lunch the, for like four hours yesterday. Four or five hours. So I missed it. I really wanted to watch it. But I might watch the VOD. It seemed cool. Um, but yeah, I just missed the MCC because I didn't want to watch it, but sad to hear there's drama involved. Scott seems, uh, Scott seems pretty cool, uh, and I, I doubt he meant anything negative with what happened, and you know, it's good to remember it's just a game, and it's also, they don't pick content creators whose whole thing is becoming insanely professional at Minecraft, they pick content creators who are funny and who are, like, um, good for personalities. It's not like an ultra-competitive tournament, like, CSGO stuff is, you know? With, like, official, you know, casting and stuff like that. It's just meant to be fun. So, that's a good thing to keep in mind um, every time MCCs happen. It's okay to get upset in the moment, but it's best not to let it destroy your overall happiness at watching the thing happen, you know? Because that's what we're all here for, is just to enjoy our content creators doing fun things. Which is why I'm streaming Lego. <laughs> Alright, this is annoying because <laughs> I have to put like the little tiny circle on the little tiny cube and then place it in this little tiny slot. Real frustrating, but it's fine. This song I can kind of hear. I try to keep it a little lower so that it doesn't come through my mic again and echo, but um, I can kind of hear it. It's, it sounds pretty nice. Hope you guys are enjoying it, because it sounds nice. It's only because he works with Nox Crew Tested Maps and knew some stuff and he had an advantage. Yeah, but he, I also know that, I mean, from what I was reading, he he always has an advantage. The only difference is this is a new map, so people have new... Just don't know what's happening. But also, <laughs> my friend was talking about it and they were like, Dude, there was huge arrows pointing to where the content creators needed to go. Like, they should have known where to go. Um, so, uh, I mean, you know. Even if he had the advantage, it's not like he wins every time, you know? I, I I really can't blame the dude for using what he had to win. Like, 
it happens. I I don't I just don't think it's fair to yeah uh you know people sending him death threats or like calling him the F slur like that stuff's just not okay. I think it's just important to uh you know make sure everyone feels comfortable, everyone's chilling, and just remember it's just a game. And I think after that. If you remember it's a game, if you remember it's it's a thing, you can just let him know. Like, dude, that wasn't cool. I don't think that was cool. Still love you, but, you know, hopefully next time it'll be a little more fair. And, I mean, I'm sure they've taken that to heart after everything that's happened. I'm sure next time the same thing won't happen again. But, um, still not fair how it went about getting them to change it, you know what I mean? We need 12 of these little slope things. The tiny pieces are in these little bags, and I don't want to pour them out because I feel like I'll lose them. <laughs> but it might be better to just pour. I'm trying to stop myself though because I know that I'll end up regretting it. Um, okay, so we need... Um, I wasn't mad about it at all. Um, it was fun. Yeah, that's fair. I'm glad you had fun, for, for sure. I'm, I'm glad you got to enjoy it regardless. Um, I, I saw a funny tweet that was like a screenshot of, um, Instagram, of an Instagram story poll, and it was like, hey, first of all, how many of you enjoyed the MCC, and how many of you watched Twitter during, or looked at Twitter during or after the MCC? And the same amount of people who enjoyed it were the people who didn't look at Twitter. Um, so yeah, I definitely think Twitter was just a big part of why it, it got so blown up, is because... I've been trying to think of a word way to word this thought uh, on Twitter, but I didn't think it was good to put it there, but it was like Twitter is so polarized because we only have 280 characters to use to word our thoughts. So when you say something, you don't make it nuanced. You just yell about it. <laughs> and that's just how Twitter works. That's how the community works. That's how the app works in general. And because of that, things get blown up so much because instead of saying hey this dude's like let's let's say you're trying to cancel someone you say hey this dude's pretty bad i think they're not a terrible person but this thing they did is pretty bad i hope they change instead on twitter that becomes this dude's terrible the thing he did is terrible because we have no way to word all of that in one tweet or else people or at least people don't want to people just want to you know Twitter's meant to be fast-paced. It's you just scroll, you like things, you 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 tweet quickly. People don't want to spend their time actually writing it out thoughtfully, which ends up blowing things up. Which can it can still be fun, because uh, you can be like it, you know it can also lead to good interactions. You can be like, hey, you know, I I I love you know if someone posts a nice picture, you can be like, oh my god, I love you. Uh, and that's just a quick, nice thought. You don't have to say, oh, this looks nice, this looks nice. Uh, you know, I really like how you did this. You can just be like, oh my god, this is amazing. And that quick, split-second thought can be really nice for someone to hear. I posted a picture. I don't post pictures of myself often, but I posted one on Twitter, and everyone was really nice about it, and it made me feel so much better about myself. So, it's definitely not all bad as a platform. It's just that one thing can kind of ruin it sadly all right we gotta make four little sculptures that look uh like this like that just gotta make four of these little guys um very very cute cute little boys but yeah i mean i guess that's why i like um, Il Mango and Psycraft, they're kind of a, they're not in the, in the spotlight like MCC and stuff is, but they still are big and they still have, like, you know, a lot of clout, which means that their streams are fun, they get a lot of interaction, they get a lot of, uh, support and suggestions and things, so I like watching them, and I wanted to watch their tournament because of that, because they... Um, people would be rooting for them in the chat and Twitch a big part of Twitch is like, you know It's about the community. It's about raids. It's about bits. It's about subs. It's about, you know, everyone being communal So it's really 
that's why I like the, watching their stuff because it's like it doesn't get overwhelming, it doesn't get uh, up- upsetting, but everybody still has a good time. Everybody is still, um, you know, just vibing, rooting for their favorite person while still accepting if other people lose. All that, all that good stuff. Just good sportsmanship. That's why I talk about Rooster Teeth so much. Rooster Teeth is like my favorite company. They, they're a production company if you don't know them. Um, been around since like just before YouTube. And I, I love their stuff because they're, they're big but they're kind of off the radar on... Um... Oh hey QWERTY! It's a fire table? Yeah, my um, one of my family members made it. I think she's technically a cousin, I don't know. Our family's pretty big so I don't always remember all that stuff. But uh, I believe it is befitting gifts on Instagram. B e f i t t i n g g i f t s. Correct me if I'm wrong. If you can find it and you think it's the correct one, but she made this table herself. It's it's amazing. They gave it to us when we went to India, and um, it's awesome. Yeah, they've made Ruby and Camp Camp. Yeah, yeah, that's them. They've made Ruby Camp Camp. They've made Genlock. They've made a um, bunch of cool animations like that. And then they also have Achievement Hunter, which is their ga- like. One of, one of their gaming sub-departments of their company, they also have like Funhouse, Couchop, I don't know if Couchop's still around, I don't really watch all that stuff, but um, Achievement Hunter is my favorite by far, I love their stuff, um, I've been trying to show them more support, because recently one member, it turned out that he um, was just a bad dude, did some terrible things with fans and stuff, so he got kicked out. It kind of hurt the company a lot, so I've been sure I've been watching their stuff more without him in it, just to see how they're doing. And um, they've been doing pretty well. They've been they've been doing well to fight um, the terrible things that were happening without them knowing, and I can respect them for that. Um, it's terrible to hear that, especially of a friend to hear that a friend did something like that, um, but. Man, I-, I can't imagine it, but it's, it's, you know, they've been doing well to bounce back and, and try to just forget about all of that and, and make sure it doesn't happen again, but move on from all of it, you know, which I think is fair. But that's why I like them. They have a good community for the most part. Uh, I actually don't fuck with their community too much. I've been watching Ruby with my friend because they've been into it for like five, six years. I haven't watched it yet. I want to. It's been on my list. They also have another show called RVB. That was their first show ever, Red vs. Blue. Um, that was the f- show that started Rooster Teeth. I've wanted to watch that for ages as well, but um, I just haven't had a chance. But both sound super cool. Ruby, yeah, you know Red vs. Blue. Ruby is amazing because the creator seemed like such a cool dude. Um, it was sad to hear that he passed away. I wasn't around when it happened. Um, so it didn't hit me like it probably hit the community, but, you know, I can respect them trying to keep his vision in the show, from what I've heard. And to, to, to keep his vision going, because the dude w- had a lot of ideas, you know? Yeah, and he voiced a, voiced a character to his brother voices that character now. Oh, I didn't know that. That's super interesting. I, um, yeah, I mean, from I literally watched a community-made video um, about Monty and, you know, um, his life and how he got hired at Rooster Teeth, and his story's amazing. He just learned animation on his own time, and he became, he made such a cool thing that Rooster Teeth came to him, like, we want you to work for us. Like, this dude's passionate, this dude, like, I, I just, that's a level that I wish I could be at, of that much passion and that many ideas. Um, and uh, it's just so interesting. It's so cool. Seriously, I, I, I I don't even know what to say about that. It's just crazy. But, um, you know. (sighs) Ah, he's, he's like a, I'm sure he's, he's a, um, idol to all, to a lot of people. I don't know what the word is. Just, I'm sure people look up to him a lot because of his you know, work ethic and his ability to just push through and, um, you know, enjoy his life. I think that's something a lot of people lose 
nowadays is like that like hey you're supposed to enjoy your life because we get so wrapped up in like you know either politics and drama or uh work and we're like ah you know i'll enjoy later i i actually watched a really interesting uh, ellie ellie tweeted about a video that i ended up watching it was um it's by uh, what, what's that? It, I don't know how to pronounce a YouTube channel because I haven't watched it often, but I've seen it on YouTube a lot. It like they make videos that are really nicely animated. It's like Kyrgyzset or something like that. Um, and they made a video that was like called the Tail End, and it was like about your life and what you want to do with your life. And that really spoke to me because they were they were talking all about how like you know we we work so that we can retire, but when we retire we aren't going to be in the prime of our life anymore. So instead of waiting till you retire, you know, is that really what you want to do? You want to wait till you retire? You want to be this really old person who, you know, has less, you know, youth in him? Or do you want to enjoy your life while you're here instead of risking not having the time to enjoy it later? It's really important. It's, a, it's an important concept to think about. Um, and that one spoke to me when I watched it because it was like, yeah, you're right, you know? I may be just a teenager, I have time, I have a lot of time, but at the same time, I have no time, you know? Because everything goes by so fast, and, you know, people pass away before their time. I mean, I, you know, people at our school, we found out, passed away. COVID has made things a lot scarier. So it's, while it's good to stay positive, it's also good to enjoy your life. You put it in words? Yeah. <laughs> to the best of my ability, anyway. It's easy to think when you're doing something a little more mindless like Lego, you know? But, um, you know. Stay positive, but don't let yourself just completely be, you know, content with where you are. You know, you should never really be content. I, I feel like you should always be pushing for something better. Even if you've settled down, you have like a nice family and stuff, you should always be pushing to make it better for the, your family and make it better so you can all be happy together. Um, and that doesn't necessarily mean working more. That doesn't mean, you know, putting in more hours or something. That could just mean, you know, making an investment into something that you think you and your family can enjoy like a pool or something or just you know maybe it could mean just doing less work so you can spend more time with your family who knows i don't know it's just i don't know i saw this tweet a while ago that was like i can't believe we as humans decided you know instead of just chilling naked eating grapes by a, a, a like pond or a lake we decided we should go the route of like, I don't know, you know, getting all wrapped up in all this money and crap. And that was such a true tweet. It's like, yeah, why, why are we, you know, animals don't do this. Animals, you know, obviously animals have different struggles. They have to try to survive and stuff. But, you know, they, they, at the same time, they're free, right? Isn't that an important thing to be? So, I don't know. It's just interesting. We get, we, we're so like sprung into this work life that we feel like we should have that we don't take the time to just sit down and play with Legos. Where do these go now? How are we doing this? Ah, they're like arches. I see. I see. I can do that. I can make an arch. I know how arches work. Just gotta center it, and then we're good. This is coming along real nice. I'm, I'm very much enjoying this. I'm, I'm enjoying having this conversation with you guys as well. I didn't know people like just chatting this much, actually. Um, <laughs> I normally don't see too many new people in the chat, so it's, it's pretty cool. I'm glad uh, just chatting is something you guys like. Because honestly, I was I was very like unsure of how Twitch worked before I started streaming. I started streaming because of Ellie, because uh, 
Ellie had a big channel on YouTube, or has, right? He doesn't post on it, but he has it. And um, if you don't know, Ellie's my friend. He makes remixes for Hermitcraft and stuff. Um, and, or I should say remixes the hermits. Doesn't make it for them. Probably better phrasing, but you know, he ha he has a big channel on YouTube, so I was like, yo, you should stream on, on Twitch, that'd be pretty fun, you know? You already have a community on there, or you could. And he was like, alright, you know, I'll do it. And then he, like, pushed me, um, <laughs> he was like, alright, now you start streaming, because he thinks I'm funny, so then, <laughs> that's how I ended up doing this. But before that, I didn't watch Twitch, I didn't know how it worked. I, I knew the bare bones of it, of like, you can watch a stream, you can donate bits, you can drop subs, you can follow. And other than that, I was like, no idea what I'm doing, but uh, it's been interesting on here. I, I like this platform. I was thinking for a while, like, should I move to YouTube? I mean, it'd probably help with discoverability, but the problem is you don't have a good community there. This is something Harris Heller puts a lot in his Alpha Gaming channel. Um, which is a channel that's like meant to help small creators like me to to understand the algorithm and understand how to grow. And um, something interesting that he always talks about is like he switched from Twitch to YouTube, but um, you know, his suggestion wasn't for small creators to switch from Twitch to YouTube. He did it, but he's not telling us to do it because we need that community. We need people. To, to show up, to we need raids, raids are so helpful, uh, th th those things just don't happen on YouTube yet, which sucks, I, I hope YouTube, you know, can test Twitch so that it'll help both uh, groups grow, but at the moment, it doesn't have that, which is why um, I'm not switching right now, because it would be stupid to switch when y you have, like, a lower chance of growing which is ironic because twitch is a very like it's an isolated platform like a lot of people on twitch don't necessarily go to your twitch or, or to your twitter or instagram or youtube or whatever or tiktok it's a very isolated oh posture check thank you thank you for that <laughs> i i lean over a lot when i'm doing legos but yeah they you know people on twitch don't necessarily want to move to other platforms they want to stay there um, so it's, it's interesting that you would say like, oh, you know, you'll probably grow better if you're on Twitch because how would you? But it makes sense when you think about it because raids and, and like collabs and dual streams, multi streams, which work on Twitch. I don't know if they work on YouTube. I don't think they do. Um, those things just help you meet people, help people meet you, I guess. It's interesting. I like talking about algorithms and stuff. I think... AI is very interesting, and that's basically what social media is, is a bunch of general AI, simple AI kind of just helping humans meet each other and see each other. Because if it didn't have AI, I would just see the people I know on my Twitter and Instagram. Um, and even then, I doubt an AI would be able to show you know, if I didn't have an AI, I don't know if I would still see the things that my friends post. Um, at least, not the interesting things that I want to see. Twitch has a bigger sense of community to me than YouTube. Yeah, that's the main thing, right? That's exactly what I'm saying. Is like, that's 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 why Twitch is so much better for live streaming. Because if you're doing everything, if you're doing shorts, if you're doing videos, and you do stream sometimes along with that, yeah, you you'll probably do pretty okay on YouTube. Your streams won't pop off like they do on Twitch, but they'll be okay. But if you want to put effort into streaming, you can still do videos and shorts and things on YouTube while doing streams here. For now. Until YouTube changes their community. Which, I don't know when that's going to happen. Or if. They're definitely putting more effort into YouTube shorts right now. Um, which makes sense, because TikTok's just popping. And YouTube uh, wants to be more like TikTok right now. Um, that new shorts tab sucks, I'm going to be honest. <laughs> They're gonna need to fix their algorithm for YouTube Shorts if they wanna, if they wanna actually compete with TikTok. But yeah, they're definitely putting more effort into that than live streaming right now, which makes sense from a business standpoint. But if YouTube wants to survive long term, 
Which, I mean, they've been surviving for so long, I can't imagine them dying anytime soon. I mean, they're bought by Google, so chances are they'll never die. But if they want to survive and they want to keep going, they are probably going to have to put some effort into stuff that isn't trendy, right? Because, like, TikToks are good, TikToks are going to be around for a while, but right now they're extra trendy. The fact that they survive, even with, like, governments and stuff trying to kill them, like, governments banning them and stuff... The fact that they still survive that, it shows how important they are uh, for mostly kids as a platform. Like, TikTok's an important pl- platform for kids to be on. Uh, it would not have survived if it wasn't if it wasn't that important, I guess. But um, at the same time, you know, those shorts don't lead to more... Like, they're not necessarily going to lead to more follows. Because when you... When you have a short, when you make a short, people want to be able to see it, scroll through it, go to the next one. They're not about to stick around for 20 minute videos that you post as well, right? They're, they're not going to f- look at your page and see, oh, this dude also makes like 20, 30 minute videos that I want to watch. Like, yeah, sure, I'll follow. Like, no, they just want to scroll through unless they see something ex- exceptionally good um, that they really like. So for the most part, you know, TikToks and stuff won't necessarily lead to you becoming a bigger creator. So that's why I think YouTube needs to focus more on live streaming. Um, Oh, Hydrate. Thank you for that. Uh, And also Ben Jones 12. Thank you for the follow. Welcome. If you guys have water at home, take a bit of a swig because we just got to hydrate. Um, okay, okay, so we are not moving on from this guy, but we are gonna make something a little new for a second and then go back to him, it looks like. There we go. I'm gonna have to clean up my bed. This is my bed, by the way. (laughs) I'm just sitting on my bed right now, so I'm gonna have to clean that up later. Because I'm just throwing all the little baggies on it, but it's chill. Uh, right, we got that's six, seven, eight, one extra. I assume this is just not going to be used because they always give us extras, especially of these little ones. Four, these big pieces. There's a lot of pieces I gotta get through right now before I can start this next tiny project so let's just get all these ready to go but yeah it's fun talking to you guys about this stuff i i think um it's important to talk about how things work um i was actually talking to i i'm going to college soon i gotta start looking into colleges soon so i was talking to a college counselor at my school um and we were talking about things i like just to figure out where i want to go because i have no idea what i want to do when i grow up um and she was like, I, and I had this computer fan that was broken. So I was telling her about how like, I wanted to fix it. I didn't want to just pay for a new one right away. I still haven't paid for a new one. It's fine. It's a little janky, but it works. And she was like, see the difference between you and me is that I would pay for a new one right away. And so I didn't realize that not everyone likes talking about how things work. They don't like figuring out how to fix things, which is fine. I totally get that. It takes more time than it's worth sometimes. Sometimes it's annoying to figure out how things work, but I definitely like talking about that stuff. I very much enjoy talking about, like, um, you know, how Twitch and, and YouTube work and the metas for each one. And, you know, I'm a gamer. I'm, I mean, I'm a variety streamer, so I, I love, you know, figuring out metas for different games and things, figuring out how games um, physics works and stuff. I mean, that's why I popped off at Fall Guys when Ellie and I first started playing, is I just learned how the physics worked right away, which was something that Ellie didn't do. Um, Or at least from my knowledge, he didn't put that much effort into. Which is why when when it came down to it, I was getting a bunch of wins, and it took him longer to get wins, because he wasn't learning, like, the different metas. I don't know. It's just an interesting little thing to think about. I think, I don't know. It's because you, I don't know. It's like when you 
grow up, you grow up in a world where so much is already figured out. So it's nice to catch up on the history of what you missed, right? Like figuring out like, oh, so that's how the world works, you know? I, I missed all this because I wasn't born yet. That stuff's pretty cool. I like learning that stuff. And there's just some days when you can just close your mind and make stuff. All right, wait, hang on. So now I gotta do this. Gotta put this in the center. No, no, it's not in the center. It's on this corner and put this crooked. Whoa, crazy. We're getting, we're getting wacky with it. Look at that guys, it's crooked. Isn't that crazy? Can't believe, uh, they're, they're breaking rules. <laughs> then, so the crooked thing goes over here. It looks like, right? Yeah. Looks good. That looks right. I think that's correct. Opposite side, like that. Just make sure this is correct because this was a little bit confusing. Um, yeah, cool. That was a nice little, nice, smart little play. And then we gotta do this three more times after I add. Hang on, what? I gotta add another weird thing. Okay, cool. Oh, I understand. We gotta add these pyramid looking things. I like these little pieces, these pyramid pieces. They look nice. Put that there and put another one on right there. Like that. And then two of these weird little, what are these, motorcycles? These are like hover carts. Uh, and put them on as well. So it goes on the outside. Pokey out bits goes on the outside. Like that. And that is piece number one. I just gotta do that uh, three more times. What's up, Banana Pickle? Yes, we're making Legos. We're making the Statue of Liberty. I'm probably not gonna get through all of it. We're an hour in and I haven't even finished the first set, the first bag. So I'm thinking we do bag one and two today, maybe three if I'm feeling it. And then the other two or three next stream. We'll try to finish this in two streams though, if possible. Maybe not though, we could just do five streams. Uh, woo, more Lego streams? Yeah, definitely. I'm definitely not finishing this today. What's up, Pixel Slash? What's up, dude? Welcome. All right, we gotta do this a couple more times. Let's uh, let's see if we can speed this up a bit. If we do all three at once, all three of the next ones at once. Whoa, crazy! I know, right? Revolutionary. An absolutely unprecedented idea in human history. I think the Lego police are gonna come after me after this one. Um. It definitely makes it much easier though, because I don't have to go through the instructions three more times to remember what I'm doing. My memory's so bad, I feel like if anyone else did this Lego thing, they'd remember pretty quick, like, oh, okay, so I do this and I do this. Like, even just this small section, they'd be like, okay, I gotta do this four times, I got this. I definitely could not. I would have to look at the booklet so many times. I remember when I used to really like Legos, dude, I used to love them and I fell off. And then I watched... I actually watched, I was talking about Achievement Hunter just now, I was watching an Achievement Hunter stream, or like a VOD, where the, um, one of the members, Jack, played with Legos, and that's when I was like, oh my god, Legos, I should do a Lego stream, um, and that one stream was the reason I was like, oh my god, I should definitely play with them, because it's just, there's so many things you can do in the world that sometimes I just forget, <laughs> I just forget the stuff that I enjoy, I'm like, what can I do now? What do I do? You know, I, I've, I've, I have too much time. I have no idea what to do. That's the 
consequence of choice, I guess. But, you know, worth it. At least I get to choose what to do. At least I have time for this stuff, you know? Worth it. I like this. I like that I can do a little, little skirt. I get to, I get to twist the yellow a bit, make it, make it nice and diagonal. It's absolutely like something that I thought was illegal to do. Thought the cops would come after me if I tried to diagonalize these pieces. How do I do this? Like that? That looks right. Uh, how does it look? Looks perfect. Sick. Let's do it for the rest of them. We've made some good progress today. I wasn't sure how far I'd get because it's been so long since I've done Lego. I was just like, you know, maybe I finished nothing. Maybe I finished a set. Who knows? But we're, I mean, honestly, considering I normally do two to three hour streams, I wouldn't be surprised if I get through like two sets at least. Um, I was, I used to build Lego so much I, <laughs> I built them way too fast. I, I would never build them way too fast. I'm, I'm very methodical with my work. I was more into Bionicles and Legos. I actually, when I was watching the Achievement Hunter stream I was talking about, I think Jack brought up Bionicles once. I've never heard of them before that. If you have a picture of any Bionicles you've worked with, feel free to, feel free to throw them in my Discord. I'd love to see them, just tag me if you want, if you have Discord, no pressure, but I, I would love to hear what those are. I'll search them up after if, if, uh, if I remember, because I would love to maybe do a Bionicle stream. Are they fun? Are they fun when you're like older? Legos are fun for adults because you can just get like big Lego structures. Are Bionicles good when you're older, or are they just kind of kids' things? I, I forgot to mention this, but when I bought Legos, when I bought this Lego set, uh, or at least when I was picking out what I wanted to buy, I literally searched up hardest Lego sets, and I just went through that. That's how I found the Marvel Helicarrier one, um, which I'll buy another time. But um, this one, this set wasn't on there. I, again, I had to change what set I was getting due to um, how long it would take to arrive. But I, I, wanted, I wanna get the hardest one out there, which I think is like the Millenn Millennium Falcon or something, one of the Star Wars things. Um, I have no clue with Bionicles, you build characters. They're really cool though, there's a whole show. Oh, Ninjago, yes, I love Ninjago. Oh my god. I think I have some Ninjago uh, sets in a box. I can actually, I have a cardboard box. I I bought a new cabinet that was supposed to house all my Lego stuff, and then I just never put the Lego stuff in there. But I have um, a cardboard box that holds all my Lego stuff until I clear it out. So I can show you some of my Ninjago stuff. I didn't know there's a Bionicle show though, that sounds cool. I wonder if Ninjago still holds up today. Whoops. Let's just grab that before it gets lost. Um, I wonder if it holds up, because I know a lot of Disney stuff does not hold up anymore. I tried to watch Kickin' It, that uh, martial arts show. It is so bad. It's so, like, white savior complex. It's weird, man. It gets real weird, like from episode one, so then I just stopped watching it. Which sucks, because I loved it when I was younger. It's the reason I took martial arts classes when I was younger. But, you know. You grow up and you realize that those things fade. Those things are, are real. They just get real weird, especially with Disney, with their, with their weird little, like, jokes I really like the dragons in Ninjago I really liked it as a kid too yeah the 
Mythic Dragons. I don't even remember half the Ninjago's lore, Ninjago lore or like stories. It's been so long. Did you just alright? That looks correct from everything I see so far. Alright. We're good. We're good so far. Oh god, dude, I'm gonna need a lot of pieces for, the next, for this next part. Did I not need these? Didn't I ask for this stuff? Or was that just sitting there? Maybe it was just sitting there. We're gonna move it over here. Nice knuckle crack. Needed that. Then they switch from dragons to sports cars. I'm pretty sure I have the sports cars. It's those little wheeler things, right? The little zoomy things. Like, they're like chariots, but more electric. Um, I think I have some of those. I think I have like two sitting in my box. All right, what we need now is these, four of these. 24 of these, so that's gonna be some counting. Four. All of these little things. Yep, zoomy things, yeah. I have some. I um I don't know if I even watched Ninjago during the dragon phase. I have no idea. It's been so long. But um I mean The zoomy things are pretty cool too. Probably not as cool as dragons, but still pretty sick. Eight of those what else do I need? I need some- here's the problem now. I need some of these flat pieces and I don't know which ones are flat and which ones have bumps. Um, uh, need eight of these things. Well that sucks. <sighs> Four. What sucks is also like, you would think that these little bumps, they wouldn't have them on the bottom. And they don't really. But like, you know, you can barely tell the difference between the bumps on the bottom, so you have to actually flip them over to figure out which ones you want, which is frustrating. I actually tried rewatching it, but I could not get into it because of the animation quality. That's honestly the reason I haven't started watching Ruby yet, is because the quality is not great, which obviously makes sense because it's like so old, but it's just made it so much harder for me to get into it. I know I should, because I know it gets so much better and it's just like such a good show um, from everything I've heard, but that plus just not having enough time to, I just haven't started it yet, it sucks. I remember my favorite being Kai and yeah, I think it's because I was bi and I didn't know it yet. Um, I love when people talk about their like gay awakenings or whatever. Uh, one of my favorite ones is Melon, one of my... Uh, Twitch mods, one of my friends, um, he was just like, my gay awakening was Dra Draco Malfoy. And then everyone in the replies to that tweet was like, yep, same, same, love him. I was like, what? <laughs> Where? Why? <laughs> He's the classic rich kid. Why would you do this to yourself? But yeah, that's a funny little thing to hear every time is just... The, the the characters that we latch on to when we're kids. It's always real funny. Sorry, am I in the frame? I think I am. I think that's a valid awakening though. Apparently a lot of people think it's a valid awakening and I, who am I to blame you, dude? Y'all do your thing. I, I hated, I hated just, I hated Harry as a character. He always stressed me out. I don't really remember Draco, but I'm pretty sure Draco was like the wizarding version of racist. Like he called people like, I don't know, some word against muggles or something that you're not supposed to use. I don't really remember the lore, but yeah. But hey, I mean, I can't blame you if you like what you like. I think it's funny when people uh, latch onto certain characters. 
and it's totally fair. <laughs> the wizard version of racist, isn't it though? <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's what it was. Man, I don't remember the story at all, but from my from my my memory, it's that was just what that was supposed to be. A lot of the writing in Harry Potter is weird, though. Like the fact that the those creatures like to be enslaved. The Dobby is that was was he like a dwarf or something? A gnome? What was he? I don't remember. He wasn't a gnome. I know he wasn't a gnome. I can I know for sure that that was false. But I don't remember what uh, Dobby was. Right, we gotta make these a couple times. Let's do this again. A goblin thing. Yeah, goblin. One of those classic D&D &D words that I just don't know. God, I want to get into D&D &D so bad. I tried it once, but my ADHD just wouldn't let me get through it. Like, I, I just couldn't, I couldn't listen. The DM would keep telling us things and I'd be like, sorry, where am I? Like, what am I doing? Do, do I need to do something? Do I need to roll? And they were like, you know, they were like pretty nice about it. But I was just like, I'm sorry. I, I'm sure your story is super entertaining and I feel real bad I'm not listening to it. But I just don't have the brain. <laughs> I just don't have the brain for it. Uh, I only read Harry Potter in 2015, 16. I don't remember much. Sometimes I only listen when my character's in Exactly, that's, what I, that's exactly what I did the first time I played it. So then I ended up leaving. I was just like, I'm sorry, I just can't do this right now. Um, and I had other reasons to leave too. Uh, but, yeah. I think I read Harry Potter when I was in second grade, and I'm in 11th now. So I definitely have no idea what happened in that damn book. Um, I read, because also what happened was I read the entire thing in second grade um and i was so young that i probably missed so much i probably skimmed through so much uh and i probably like just like there's like some character like tonk or something who i don't remember reading about but everyone that i talked to was like yeah she was like a huge part of the book or like she was really important or how do you not know who she is i was just like i don't <laughs> remember ever reading about anything about her so clearly my knowledge of Harry Potter is very skewed. Um, even that one creepy, not creepy, like just quirky girl who could see the dead horses or whatever. I don't remember, it just, uh, just, I'm so bad at explaining it, but that one girl who, uh, crap. I don't even remember her name or anything, but she like, I know that she was in that book and that she was important. I don't remember anything about her. Other than like the first time Harry saw death and saw the the, the ghost uh, horses, the ones that drove the chariots or whatever, the, the cabins thingies. I remember that was um, the moment that she talked to Harry and was like, yo, you're normal. Like I see this too. But that's the one thing I remember about her. I'm sure she was real important. Oh, I did this wrong. Crap. Um, I'm sure Harry Potter is like a good book or an okay book. I know the author has had her share of problems online, but um, people still seem to like the book. Um, I wanted to say, watching the animation quality improve in Ruby is honestly part of the walking experience. I love seeing how it improves with each font. Yeah, so that's the thing. It, the same thing happens with Red vs. Blue. I got through like one through seven seasons of Red vs. Blue before I kind of fell off and forgot about it. And now I'm restarting it eventually just so I can remember everything that happened. But seeing the animation jump from like, I think it was in like season five or something. It just went. Like you could see it, it was no longer a game. It was an animation show. It was not Halo anymore. Like, you could tell. Um, so I can't wait to see that with Ruby, because I'm sure that you just see that jump as well, just... You know, even because I watched, um, Rooster Teeth made this show called Dead Little Roosters. Or they had a couple versions of it, it was like 10 Little Roosters, 11 Little Roosters, 12 Little Roosters, and then Dead Little Roosters is the most recent one. They're all shows about, like, murder mystery. So it's like, in 10 Little Roosters, 10 people are, are in a, in a, in a, you know, studio or whatever. One is getting picked off one by one, blah, blah, blah. That classic uh, story. 
So in Ten Little Roosters, I think, the original, they make a joke about animation or whatever, and they kind of talk like in the joke they show what they do to animate Ruby. Uh, kind of a little bit. So that was really interesting to see because you can see kind of how things changed from when they started and ended. Or not ended, but how they got to. It's very interesting. I, I, I love seeing that stuff. And I'm sure Ruby is an incredible story uh, and like just masterpiece at this point. Considering how many people love it, I, I would not be surprised. How do I put this in? Okay, so this is on top and like that I think I'm doing it correctly that looks right hog ho champ let's go now we just gotta do it three more times and we've made the I guess walling the exterior wall of this Statue of Liberty this is gonna be a really nice little like decoration piece that's for sure it looks real nice already Love this thing so far. Yeah, hell yeah. Look at us, dude. Look at us making this absolute masterpiece. All right, we've got another one of these um, things that we gotta do four times. Um, all right, cool. Sometimes I just need a second to, to breathe. Just be like, moving on. <laughs> We're getting real close to being done with set one though. These are all the pieces left from set one. I wouldn't be surprised if this is the last thing I gotta do. Yeah, this is the last thing for set one and we are about an hour and a half in. Take a break when you need. Yeah, I'm probably gonna take like a two minute break to get some water after set one's done then we can move on to set two. I think we can probably do it. All right, so what do we need? I'm gonna just, I'm sure there's a couple extra pieces here, so I'm gonna just split these up into exactly what I need. The extras can go to the side. So that's, I need eight of these. It's nice. You know, I think every other time I've played with Lego, I didn't do it by set. I just literally opened every single box, dumped them all in a, in a big bowl, and just picked through. That was in that was an insane way to make Lego. That I was a lunatic. <laughs> that was horrible. I don't know how I did that, but uh, I'm gonna be honest. This is much better. <laughs> this is a much smarter way to do it. I have no idea how I managed to do that. You've learned. I have learned. I've learned what an idiot I was. Cause that was stupid. That was such an idiotic way to do it. I wasted so much time looking for pieces when I could have just not done that. You know what I mean? I could have just been done like so much sooner with so many builds. Then again, Lego's not about rushing. It's about enjoying the process. Uh, but I can't say I enjoyed looking for pieces all the time. That's for sure. Definitely did not enjoy doing that every time, but uh, I'm enjoying it this time because I don't have to look for a billion pieces. I need 12 of these little pyramid things. Probably some of the best pieces in this set. They look real nice. Uh, what is that? Five, nine. That's not a pyramid. You're an imposter. Like Among Us. Aha. Uh, I said 12, right? Yeah, 12. So this pyramid can go to the side. I know I'm not gonna use this. I know this isn't part of it either. Um, four of these. I think none of these are part of it yet. Four of these things. Four of these. And... That's it. So these all go to the side. Goodbye, friends. You are all useless. <laughs> Unneeded. Alright, now we're gonna do this step by step once and then we're gonna do it three more times. This. Oh wait, did I miss one? 
Oh no, okay, I gotta use this piece. Interesting. Hang on. Okay. Oh, okay, so I gotta do it like this. And then place this next to this piece. Is that, is that right? Did I do that right? I did not. Okay. This one's... This one... Oh, wait, how do I do it? Oh, like that. This one's definitely messing with me a little bit more. I should probably do this correctly. Hang on. This piece, I gotta stop shit talking it. It's pretty good. Um, okay, so we want. Oh, okay. I was just being an idiot. Okay, so if we just put that on like that and then place this here, that is correct. See, my problem is that I'm very. I'm, I very much like twist all of them around like I'll just do this while I'm playing with it and then I it ruins the perspective for me so I gotta stop doing that it's much easier if you just stay in one perspective as they tell you to put this to side do a six and uh two here it looks like another two here Then the little what what did I call these like motorcycles? Hang on, you can't even see them. Like these things, they're like little motorcycles that float, hover hover bikes, and some pyramids. Why play Lego if you aren't naming the pieces your own piece names? I wonder if I'll get the Among Us piece, <laughs> Among Us shaped piece in in this set. It's not impossible. Maybe I will. What's smart is with a lot of these pieces, they reuse pieces. Like right over here, I could have used a nine piece, but instead they just make a bunch of six pieces to use a six and a three, which is smart. Probably better for their money making, you know? Factories have to make less um, different pieces and stuff. Also means that I get to do a little bit more. I get to, I get to work on stuff a little more. All right, same as last time. Let's uh, let's let's do three in a row, all together, step by step. Let's break the law of Lego Land <laughs> because Legos have laws too. This will be the final thing for this little section this first part which is very cool my parents are actually out right now but I want to send them a picture of what we've done so far I want to just be like yo check this out isn't this sick I made this with my own hands isn't that awesome they probably won't care because Legos are like kind of a kids thing but also they're an adults thing too. Adults can do this. I'm not in denial that I'm still a child. They're very relaxing. They very much are. I love them. The nice little clicks as you snap them into place. The feeling like you're actually doing something with your hands. It's not like it's not like a super squishy, soft, um, thing, it, you know, it does hurt sometimes, you do have sharp corners, but it doesn't actually make you bleed, it just, it feels like you're doing something with your hands.
it's like those color books too yeah my sister has some adult color books she was very into that for a while um i'm sure they can be very helpful i never really played with them too much but i would not be surprised if they help you relax a little bit maybe i'll buy one maybe i'll do a coloring stream could be fun I want to do more relaxing stuff and like just chatting stuff because honestly I've kind of avoided not avoided I haven't had a reason to do just chatting streams for a long time like I started streaming I got affiliate back in November December so that's when I properly started streaming um before that I was mostly just streaming with Ellie um so I feel like you know since then I, I haven't I haven't really known what to do, I've kind of just been playing games and going with it. So I haven't really streamed, like, stuff like this, fun little Lego things or anything like that, I don't know. I just haven't thought about it. But I think I should do this more, more things like this. What's wrong? How do I do that? Hang on. Oh, it's because you put it on the other side. That's why. I just mixed it up a little bit in my head. And then this goes here. That. We are almost done. We put a six over here. Three over here. I imagine that it must be hard making these sturdy. Or at least from the, when I wonder in the beginning of Lego, how long did it take them to make a bunch of like projects that were proper sturdy? Because they had to make them nice looking while also making sure that they don't just collapse on themselves. I'm here to let you know that this stream should go in the IRL category. Is there a new? Is there an IRL category? I didn't know there was one. And I can't tell if you're fucking. Me. Sadly cannot stay, but I'm amazed by how little you forget. Fuck off, bro. I've gone so far. What is it? Is it called IRL? What's it called? Oh my god, is there a bunch of new categories? Music, sports, art. What the heck? There's so much art. <laughs> what? Okay. Is it just called the in real life category or something? I thought just chatting was fine. What is it called? Because when I type in IRL, there's nothing for it. So you're lying to me. Or I have no idea what the category name is. Okay. Let me know if you, if, if any of you know. Because I'm going to keep it just chatting for now. Because I am just chatting with you, but I also just don't know what the other category is. How is this? Oh, okay, okay, okay. We're gonna we're gonna finish off the the top of this thing. You know, I'll make this nice for you guys. Look at that. I put this in here. Boom, nice and clean. We're gonna do it on all the other sides too. Let's go. Boom, and satisfying. Wow, real nice. You know, let me get this one close. Maybe it's a tag. Yeah, maybe it is a tag. It just. It's, it's, it's all it's all janky and then we just click that into place and satisfying real nice and that's set one complete look at that isn't that great maybe it's a tag let's see if it's a tag let's let's see if if you were lying to me thanks Neeks. I'm I'm proud of this I've done, I've come so far let's see if it is a tag IRL Maybe in real? I, I don't see it at all. Ellie, you're lying to me, bro. You're a freaking liar. This looks sick. It's a freaking stand. It's the stand for the Statue of Liberty, bro. Have some respect. Put some respect on their name, alright? 
It's a stand. You see what it's a stand for? It's a stand for the damn Statue of Liberty. <laughs> Ellie likes being a dick to me. It's fine. I'm sure he's real proud of how far I've come. In, in his heart of hearts. Do the statue loser? That's look. You gotta stay tuned, bro. You got you gotta stay tuned. You gotta you gotta. <laughs> I can't give it to you first day. You gotta you gotta. Uh... Hashtag not American. Yeah, you know what? Fair enough. But um, yeah. All right, we're gonna take a we're gonna take a little break because I need I need some water, and I also want to go put these spare pieces somewhere safe so they don't get mi all mixed up with the other stuff. So, uh, give me, like, a, a couple- I don't have a taking a break to screen. I'll put you on the stream starting screen. I'll turn up the music. Enjoy the music. I'll be back in, like, uh, a couple minutes. Two, three minutes. Okay, okay, I'm doing water. I'm doing water. Alright, I drank some water. Be back soon. Drink water at home if you have any.
I'm back. I'm back. <laughs> Crazy, no. <laughs> What's up? I'm back. Sorry. Um, hi. I I changed. I I I I it was I was just taking a break. I swear. Um, yeah. We're we're. I feel I feel better. I it was getting hot in here. Turned on some AC. Got a new shirt. Got got all. The, yep. And and we're gonna we're gonna get back into it. So there we go. We got. This is how far we got so far. This is the whole first set. Statue of Liberty base, basically. Um, and we are gonna start set two. If I can find where I put set two. Let's just get the trash out of the way. There it is. Set two, right there. We're gonna start that. We are gonna um, finish this and then I'm probably gonna end, but this is gonna be a while, so. Don't worry, you got some content. <laughs> you are only a, a little late. I should probably make like a taking a break screen at some point. I normally, I used to never take breaks in the middle of, in, of um, streams. I would just go and then end when I was tired. But, um, you know, I don't know. I've, I've, I, I've found that taking a small break in the middle tends to make you more ready to do more stream instead of just ending after like an hour. Cool. Um, uh, these are all the tiny ones that are d definitely gonna get lost. Um, cool, all right. So, we're gonna start with part two and was I in the middle of a conversation or did I end my conversations? <laughs> oh yeah, we were talking about if there was an IRL tag. Ellie was lying about there being an IRL tag. There's not, apparently. Who knows? Ellie's just a freaking liar. Um, alright, what are we doing? Ah, uh, we've got another thing that we've got to do four times. Again, still very symmetrical with this, with this uh, project so far. Uh, we got to have eight tiny pieces, which means I gotta go search for these tiny, tiny pieces. Oh boy, this is gonna be fun. Maybe I shouldn't have dumped everything out, but, uh... Oh! Hell yeah! All eight pieces are in here, let's go! I don't have to search for them at all. I can just break this open. And pick them out piece by piece. Oh, wait. There's some different ones. Okay. I want these flat pieces, eight of them. That is what I'm doing right now. But some of them in this bag have bumps, which means gotta be careful which ones I pick out. You know what, fuck it. I hate, I hate doing this. Let's just make sure we didn't drop anything. I don't think we did. Cool, cool, cool. Much easier to do it this way. And thankfully these buttons are so like colorful for the most part like these red ones at least that even if they go in this section they hopefully shouldn't get too mixed up i'll probably be able, be able to find them whenever i actually need them okay, so that's eight of these pieces what else do i need 16 of these guys yeah 16 of these little camera dudes i don't know is that a camera that looks like it. when i'm building i have different boxes contains for each packet see that's smart you missed it, but earlier I was talking about how I used to just open every packet, dump them all in one box, and then go. So, this is already better than what I used to do. So, you know, I'm learning. Maybe next time I, I do this, I'll, I'll do that, what you're saying. Who knows? Maybe I'll just forget. Uh, because my memory is shit, but who knows? I'll, I'll give it a try, because it sounds like a good idea. You bloody sneaky little buggers. That's three. And one last one. We're mad close. There it is. That's 16. Alright. Um. Four. 
of these guys. They should be easy to find, I say right now. Before struggling to find them, that's three. This is like the, the longest part of making a LEGO project is looking for these pieces. I'm sure if I did what you were saying of like splitting them into different packages, um, it's called a snot. A stud knot on top. That's smart. I'll call it a snot. That's four. Alright. Eight of these guys. Oh no. There's ones with snots and ones with knots. So. I'm gonna look for just the, 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 the knot snots. We need the knot snots right now. How many do I need? Eight. Eight. Okay. We got four here. Let's get four more. Ah, I just dropped one while picking one up. That is a net positive of zero. We can't have that. But hey, thanks to everyone who's who's joined chat, who's, who's vibing here. I very much do appreciate it. I know I've been a little bit slacking with streams. Uh, or maybe not slacking, but I've definitely been around much less than I used to when I had a schedule. Um, and I do have my reasons for that, but I still appreciate everyone who's been sticking with me through these times. Um, hopefully one day I'll get back to like a more normal schedule. Uh, for now it's going to be just a little bit fluctuating because of school ending uh, and stuff like that. And just me not knowing where I'm going with stream. Because it's scary not having like a full set out plan, but it's also fun that way. Um, but it makes it a little confusing on what exactly to do next, which is why I tried this of doing like a Lego stream, something different, which has definitely been a success because I had so much fun with this so far. Um, and we've still got like a decent amount of time left before I feel like ending. So, you know, this was definitely a good idea, honestly. I shouldn't mix up these two. There's two different types of these one by one blocks. There's like the one that's got like a second stud on it, like right there. And then there's the one that's got only one stud on it. Uh, and every- I'm looking for another one with only one stud, and all of these have two. So, ah, uh, there it is. The sacred one stud. That's what we needed. And finally, I think this is final. Is it final? No, I got two more things. I got eight of these long, flat ones, which I can do. I'm vibing. I'm also vibing. This is a vibe. And that's that. I'm just going to check and make sure they're like roughly the same. Yeah, they're all the same, so I'm going to assume they're the correct size. And eight of these guys, which is also pretty easy. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. I feel like I ripped through so many pieces just with this first step. Like, I just, all of these pieces are for this first step. That's a lot, but I just got through. Anyway, let's see if we can do all four, because we have to do four sides. So we're doing this four times. Let's just see if we can do all four like at once. We need one three stud. Then we need one of the um, big studs that's flat. There we go. The one studs, as we like to call them. That's. Well, then we need, um, looks like these flat threes, add them on, making our way, man. This is also going to look amazing next to all my other stuff. Like, I have so many Lego things, I'll show you guys at the end of stream, um, a couple of them. I got so many different Lego things that... Like, I've got the White House, that's one of them. Probably, 
I feel like that one lost a lot of its meaning after the past couple years. After I've gotten into politics more and understood things more, I definitely don't think I would have bought the White House. I'm going to a cinema tomorrow, Pog. Hell yeah, dude. What are you watching? I haven't been to a cinema in so long. Uh, but yeah, I, I don't, I don't know if I would have bought the White House uh, recently, but I already have it, so that's probably one of my biggest ones. But I have a, I have a good couple of different um, Lego sets. Peter Rabbit too, because of my sister. Well, even if it's because of your sister, it sounds pretty fun. Hope you have a good time, my dude. I, I uh, it's been a long time since I've been to cinemas or just enjoyed something like that. I can't wait to go back, but at the same time, I'm gonna, I'm gonna wait until everything's like perfectly crystal clear until I go back. Chances are, I'm not gonna like. I don't think I'm that, you know. Like I when I before pandemic I didn't really go to um, cinemas that often, so I don't think I I need to go back anytime soon. I think I'll be fine. Plus they're so expensive. Speaking of movies, did you guys watch um, Cruella? Apparently that came out recently. I didn't watch it. I heard it's not great. <laughs> heard that. It kind of messes with the lore of, like, one, 101 Dalmatians. I've just started getting back into LEGO, so have I. It's been a long time since I've played with them as, as well, but, um, I recently decided to try again, and it was a good idea, because it's a lot of fun. I didn't watch Gorilla. That's fair. I, I was gonna, but you have to pay for it on Disney Plus, which is really dumb. Uh, hopefully it'll go free on Disney Plus at some point. I feel like it's so dumb to have a subscription service, then also ask people to pay for things on that subscription service. That makes no sense to me. This just broke up. Where does this go? Like that. That makes no sense to me. It feels just... It's just money grabbing at its finest, so I just said, no, nah, I'm not gonna watch it. Not now. I'll wait. I'll wait until it goes free or I'll just never watch it. Those are the two options. Your your move, Disney. <laughs> now you choose. Like in-game payouts in a game that you paid for? Yeah. Yeah, microtransactions and like a game you already paid sixty dollars for. It's basically that. buttons Easy. it's so satisfying when it just snaps into place god I love Legos imagine a world without Legos that would suck but then again we wouldn't even know what we were missing I'm sure Legos, Legos feel like a, oh crap, I keep breaking this, it's so freaking fragile, um, Legos feel like a thing that we would make in some form or another, regardless, at some point in history, because it's just, it's such a bare bones idea of building things, like, we have to build things to survive, so chances are we'd make a toy based around building things even if it wasn't specifically Lego. Because there are other versions of Lego. They're just not as popular and as, like, versatile as Lego is. There we go. Anything else? Oh yeah, I got a lot else to do, okay. Actually, not a lot else. This looks like the final part. Put it on opposite angles, and then do the big one. Like that. And 
and just like that, it looks like we've made like uh, a flat surface over here. What's up, Malone? Lego Serbia is a, f a family in poverty when their house burned down. I watched a video on the history of it. That's interesting. Holy shit. That's super interesting. Welcome to the stream, Malone. We are per currently on the second, the second part. There's five sets to get through to um finish this Eiffel, t uh, not Eiffel Tower, fucking Statue of Liberty, and um we are on the second one. And stream is gonna end after the second one ends, but I'm definitely coming back for another Lego stream soon. Cause this is so much fun. I love this dude. Who would have thought Lego would be such a fun thing? Even when you're an adult. Or I guess I can't say adult, but even when you're not like a small little toddler. Who would have thought Lego would be such a fun thing to still play with? It's such a so, uh, wait, Ari has legs confirmed. I was already wondering where all the sandy green bricks were. Yeah, sandy green's coming soon. I just gotta gotta finish the the base first. They're not legs. They're noses. That's what you gave me ideas to steal your idea. <laughs> what you're gonna steal my Lego building stream? I can't really pretend it's my idea anyway. <laughs> Alright, how do we do this part? Where is this, how does this go? What are we thinking? Uh, looks like it's just there. From what I'm seeing, that looks right. It's just literally like right there. Which looks correct yes cool um i'm still it as well i've never seen someone on twitch do this uh i've seen it uh i've seen it on youtube once and i've heard of it being a thing but yeah i haven't seen it on twitch before i'm sure it's been a thing on twitch but hey man do it i'd love to see you do it that sounds fun it, it's a lot of fun to stream this, honestly. Like, I literally just get to build a Lego thing and people watch. <laughs> on YouTube, yeah, loads, but not on Twitch. But only from big people, people like the top tier people with alcohol. I mean, I may not be like drunk, but this is still pretty cool. these little pedestal things. That's four. Twelve reds if you can find easily. Twelve. Oh, one piece is crap. This is gonna be harder to find. Where are they? Oh crap. It's these tiny little freaking these little guys. I hate them. I'm, uh, I, I, I'm real bad with angles clearly, but these little guys, I hate them. They're the hardest ones to find. One by one plates, yeah. Plate is a good word. Plate makes sense. I was gonna say one by one, but that made it seem like a meter, like a block, not a plate. But yes, plate is the perfect word for that. Plate is the official name? Yeah, I didn't know that. The one by one tiles are worse. The one by one, like, smooth tiles, those are probably the worst of the worst. 12 is what I said, alright. How many do I have? I have 6. Great. Bloody brilliant. Oh, they're all upside down, that's why. There we go. All 6, right next to each other. 36 buttons. I can find all the buttons there. That's fine. Uh, what is that? 12... 12 of these guys. 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh boy, we're so close, so close to victory. 10, 11. Need that one last one. I'm sure this is gonna piss you guys off if you can see it and I can't. One more, come on. It's not in here, is it? It's not in here, okay. And these aren't supposed to be in here. I'm just gonna keep these two split up. Ah, there it is. No, it's not. It's not that. I thought it was there. No! I'm so close. Where is it? Uh, I just realized I don't have a camera. I'm using my phone as a camera. This is a webcam. This one's a phone. Um, if you download this app called DroidCam, D-R-O-I-D Cam, it's, an, it's a free app. You can buy a paid one. I don't know what the paid one brings. I might get it just to make sure it's all professional and shit. Maybe it'll be more HD. I don't know. But um, that the paid one's like five dollars, and it. I mean, even this one's a free one and it works fine. I think the best part is with paid will be like if I do this, it'll focus more probably and be more HD. But for Twitch, it's fine because Twitch doesn't need to be more than like 720. I'm using IP cam for my phone, but I use my phone as a dashboard during Twitch. Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 that makes sense. Well, just use what you got. I don't know, figure out some janky way to do it. I literally, everything I do is super janky. Dashboard slash stream deck, that makes sense. I totally get that. All right, we just need a couple more pieces. We need four. of these guys. One, two, three, four. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Um, oh, fucking hell. Okay. This next part's gonna be real slow. Because I gotta do this 12 times. I think. Yeah, yeah, it's 12. It's 12. That's great. That's great. That's cool. That's cool. Uh, <laughs> Christ. I just have to put a bunch of buttons on these little arrows. It's gonna be real slow. I'm just gonna angle them correctly and just zoom through it. Just gonna make sure that's 6, 12. Okay. So, 1 red, 2 uh, beige. And yes, you guys can probably tell what I'm doing. It's just 1 red on the tip and then 2 beige on the other ones, which is very slow, but. You know, Lego's supposed to be slow. Lego is never meant to be. Um, I mean, I assume it wasn't meant to be who's who can make this Lego building the fastest. If it was, well, the answer's clearly not me. That's okay. This is Bob Ross in building Legos. We're gonna make a happy little arrow with buttons on it. It's like a rocket ship. You got the red guy who's driving up front, you got the two passengers. Um, they do have Lego speed building competitions, oh my god. But yeah, it's mostly relaxing. Lego used to make woodwork, really. If I had the tools to, I would love to do like a wood building stream, like making something out of wood and stuff, because I've done woodwork and stuff in my school, kind of. Like, I've done robotics, which was next to the woodwork lab, and I was allowed to take stuff from there, and, you know, we it was kind of two classes that were kind of adjoined. Um, so, I would, I would definitely love to do a stream like that if I had the stuff for it. It would probably be much less relaxing than uh, than this because it'd be super noisy. <laughs> Thankfully, Legos don't make any noise at all. But I'm sick for when you drop something really important and then scream. But that's that's besides the point. <laughs> that doesn't happen often, right? 
Cue me actually kicking this table over, that would be great. I've actually done pretty well at not like budging the table too much. Which is surprising because my legs move a lot. I tend to like jitter a lot when I have nothing to do. I guess it's because I'm using my hands so much. I'm not like moving around too much. But I was worried that I was actually gonna just, cause this thing's like, you know, it moves. And like, I can literally lift this part up. Um, did that? Hang on. Oh, my phone died. That's great. <laughs> my phone died. I totally forgot that battery is a problem. Huh. That'll, that'll be good to remember for next time. Give me a sec while I put this on charging. Hang on, just just one second here. Uh, I guess I'll, I'll, I'll do that. There you go. Or you know what? Just so I don't have to show my legs. <laughs> Give me a second. All right. Let me see if I can finagle my camera, my webcam, so that I can at least show you what I'm building. So you won't have my face, but you will have the uh, Lego, which is kind of all you really want. Oof, oof, this is gonna be difficult. I know you can't see anything, I'm, I'm currently finagling. This definitely works. This this can definitely work. I have faith. I have a lot of faith. Just give me a second. I will show you guys what I've done. I just gotta make it focus properly. But there we go. Ah, there we go. How does that look? I'm okay with that. I'm I'm very okay with this. Cool. So, cool. You can you can kind of see this. I can I can work a little bit easier, and my face is no longer a part of this equation. Oh, great! Auto framing still on, huh? Great, great, great. I will have to turn that off then. Because that is fucking with everything. Can you hear auto framing? I was using it for my face, so. There we go. It's better. I just do that. There we go. Cool! Sorry about that. Uh, it sucks that I had to get rid of my face cam, but uh, my phone is freaking dead. So, good, good to remember in the future, uh, turn, put your phone on charging while doing this stream. Alright, so, now we're stacking this on top of each other. This should get us the next part. Then, oh, okay, okay, interesting. We gotta do this button stacked on top of this three times, which really means like 12 times because we gotta do it four more times after that. These tiny pieces are some of the worst. It's so difficult to finagle them, but it's okay.
there. Correct from what I'm seeing on this sheet. And then you cap it off with one of these little pedestal things. Just like that, we have this weird little thing. And now we gotta do it three more times so that they can fit into these corner slots over here. Let me see if I can make it a little more centered for you so you can see it. Um, okay, so we start with these. These are the bases. Do three high of these arrow things that we made. Oh, I didn't hear the click. I was like, ah, oh, did it work? It did. I just didn't hear the click. Oh, it's gonna suck if I lose a bunch of notifications on my phone that I have to look at later. I never let my phone die. So I was very surprised that it just passed away. Because I'm very much not used to letting that happen. Okay, we're about to use up all of these. I probably had reds round one by ones left over to use in here. Um, yeah, that's true. Maybe. That's a pretty smart uh, thing to do if they did that. Oh, yeah, okay, so other dot. Another plate. Oh fucking hell. There we go. And one more dot. Wait, what's nice that all these dots, all these little buttons are gonna be done after this. So I can be free. Tap it off. Which means we're done with this one. Stick. So all, now I'll just have red dots left, but at least all the beige ones are out. I got the Lego ship in a bottle and in the base of it they use bright blue. Like, dude, I was actually just talking about how I wanted to get the ship in a bottle. This was my third option. My first option was Helicarrier, the Marvel Helicarrier, which has got a lot of uh, pieces in it. My second option was the ship in a bottle, which I was actually going to keep for an Instagram live or a TikTok live. I was thinking that I could just do it on there because that one's smaller. And then this was the third one. I only got this one because, well, first I did actually want it. And second, it was the only one that came in one day. Uh, the others would have come so late. I wouldn't, I wouldn't be able to stream them for a while. So I was like, all right, I'll get this one. I'll do this stream right now. Get the other ones later. Ship in a bottle might take longer. It probably wouldn't take longer than Helicarrier. I think it has much, like many less pieces. But um, I probably wouldn't finish it in one Instagram or TikTok live, but it would be good to start it on there. I feel like that'd be a good platform to do it on. It'd be more chill as well. I don't know. I just think it's smart to branch out of just Twitch because I don't use, the only other thing I use is, um, Twitter and obviously Discord, but I don't think I would do a stream in Discord. Or now, if we, I think all we have to, I don't know how we have to angle it. I assume red is on the inside, yeah. Red on the inside. It's smart that they do these little different color pieces, which are like scaffolding. Honestly, didn't notice that before. All right, we need four of these guys and four of these guys. Place them like so. Hang on. How? What? Where? When? Why? Just like this. Yep, that's right. Let's 
just with a little space in there. It's very hard for me to get my hands in here, but I don't think I even need to properly get them in there. Yeah, that works. That works. There we go. Nice and uh... What's smart about this is it holds up these, because this section felt a little, like, not sturdy to me. So this is smart, it just makes it more sturdy. Until you do something like that. There we go. It's fine. We're all good over here. Then this is going to get more sturdy after whatever the next step is. It's definitely not perfect now, it just keeps breaking. Fucking hell. Maybe I just put this on first. I feel like that'll be easier. Oh yeah, I totally didn't read it, but it told me- it, it definitely told me to put it on first in the booklet as well. I just didn't see that part. Ah, more colorful stuff. Yay. They're definitely doing that thing of like, using colorful things for the insides. I have a little random piece not really any set, so use my Master Builder tech. Yeah, no, I was talking about this earlier, but there's this TikTok guy that I follow who is like officially a Master Builder for LEGO. So the dude works to make cool things like that, um, like properly. It's pretty cool. It sounds like a fun time to just design stuff. I don't know if I have the skills for that. That sounds like a lot of work. But, um, that, it sounds cool. It sounds fun to do. I follow him? Yeah. Literally no two colors are the same. Yeah, I have a bunch of extra pieces as well, so totally get that. Ah, uh, I need four of these little pallets again. Little pedestals, as I call them. better for you guys. Maybe that's a little much, but you get a little extra lighting. There we go. His guitar and Polaroid are amazing. Oh yeah, the big rainbow guitar, right? I think I've even seen the Polaroid, actually. I remember the guitar first, but... I think I've seen both. Alright, eight of these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Ow. This desk is rickety, by the way. It's gonna break soon. I probably should not be standing right next to the- or I probably shouldn't be sitting right next to the super rickety part, but uh, I am. So, hashtag deal with it. Hashtag bad boy. Hashtag thug life. That's what we like to call them. Eight of these. These look like... What do these look like? These are, these are interesting little pieces. Six slots. They're pretty cool. How many do I need eight? I can feel that the ground isn't level here and it's making my... It's making my table shake a lot more. Take one of these. These. Two of these 
these little weird pieces that I don't have a name for. Put on two of these yellow pieces. Look like scaffolding. Let's just do that a couple times. And by couple, I mean four, as always. Always four. More snot. I learned it from looking at one of the instruction books. I learned how to fish and use a brick remover because of them. Uh, do you mean this thing? This brick remover? Or is there another type? Either way, that dude is awesome. That dude's the reason I, like, part of the reason I wanted to do this stream. Lego just brings out a joy. Yeah, that one? Yeah. Lego brings out a joy that everyone needs sometimes. Just a chill, listening to lo-fi stream. Where you can make some weird little contraptions that you're not sure how they're gonna fit together and then they do somehow your phone dies in the middle of it <laughs> alright where are these going looks like on all the edges Corners, I mean, not edges. Looks good to me. We need four of these little things. Um, and they just go like this. Even for these parts, I'm so perfection. Like, I, I go for perfection for all of these. Like. This white thing, it could have been this place, and it could have just gone around like that. It would have worked either way, but I made sure to go right by the booklet. Which is so dumb, because it changes nothing, but... It changes something for me, I don't know why. Next, we need four of these boyos. Four of these guys. Oh, oh shit, there's different grates. Hang on. It looks like eight of these double grates. A double? You're an imposter. Get out of here. Oh wait, it's just this flipped, up, flipped upside down. Never mind then. The heck, I think I missed something. Snot stud on top, yeah. What do you usually stream? Um, I'm a variety streamer, so I just kind of play games in general. Um, I have actually done a rat dating simulator, because rat is a joke in my community. I call people rat a lot. <laughs> so normally, it's uh, Minecraft, Hollow Knight has been a big one. Um, recently, I was trying to get a bunch of achievements. Um, on Xbox, I can't, I no, I'm normally just playing Xbox anyway, but I was like going for achievement specifically for a bit. Um, yeah, just kind of, I just have fun with gaming a lot. But recently, I've been just kind of, I've wanted to branch out more than just playing games because stuff like playing with Legos is also very fun to do, and I wanted to do more of that. So, yeah. Do you like racing games? Uh, I'm oh, I, I don't know. I actually don't know. I have I, I don't know. I I've tried some. I've been okay with them. I feel like I get bored with them really quickly. Um, yeah, I don't know. And yes, I did definitely play a rat dating sim once as a joke. It was very funny. It was. There's actually more games from those creators that are all about rats. Maybe I should go and finish those up, because they seem like fun. The, the rat dating sim was very funny. I might go back and play some of the other ones, because... Um... Why not, right? But yeah, I'm probably gonna try to do a lot more stuff like this, that's like... 
more chill, more just uh, Lego building and stuff like that. Just gonna branch out from just playing games. Although playing games is hella fun. And I definitely do not blame you if that's all you want to watch. <laughs> uh, make Ari mini dab? Oh crap, how am I gonna do that? You should try track mania with a certain fruity friend? Maybe. Uh, okay, wait, can I, can I just do... Uh, oh wait, okay, hang on. Let's go, let's just do... Dab! Wait, dab! Let's go, dab! Hey. <laughs> uh I tried my best, I'm sorry. <laughs> It wasn't the greatest, but the angle also isn't perfect. If you remind me, I'll try to do a better dab next stream. Because <laughs> hopefully next stream... Next stream will probably be another LEGO stream, chances are. But I'll have my cam um, my phone camera back. Recharged. Okay, this goes... Over here? Like that. Stick. Look at me, a master builder. You guys bait, I built. There we go. That's great. It's looking good so far. I'll be mania. <laughs> No, Maniacs. I swear I know how to read. You know what I really want to play is Ultimate Chicken Horse. That game looks like a lot of fun to play with friends. I need more friend games to play and then I need people to start coming over. Um, because I'm fully vaccinated and anyone else who's fully vaccinated, I will be inclined to meet with. If they... It's the last one. Six in the sand, five in the sand. I need that last one. Where are you? There you are. You're hiding from me. Uh, four of these guys. It's pronounced maniacs. Yeah, I assume so. I was trying to say it with the mania joke, but I couldn't. Couldn't get it across. Um, Malone, thank you for the bits. Just because of Lego. That's kind of you, man. I appreciate it a lot, thank you so much. Very kind of you, bro. Lego and just chatting is a lot of- it's a very good little mix. This is a good blend. I will definitely do more just chatting stuff, because this is fun. I need four of these guys. I should also just move all these over that I'm planning on using everything here. And let's just scrub all that away that I don't need. Finally using these big guys, I've, I've been waiting to figure out what they're for. Okay, 12 of you. You can... Twelve doubles. Twelve. Whoa, well, look at that. Twenty four greats. I assume that's just all of them, right? Four. There we go. And for the- okay, so we're very close to the end. Which, I was not expecting to reach so quickly, actually. Oh, not quickly, it's 2 hours and 40 minutes, holy shit. A hundred just makes it like I'm some poor, poor men's bits. Yo man, I appreciate it regardless. You guys don't need to spend money on me, I, I appreciate the thought. <laughs> just spending time watching is uh, already very kind of you, so. Here. 
cannot believe we're so close to the end. Look at how far we've come. We've built a beautiful little guy so far. In the last three sets we'll probably do next stream. Hopefully. I actually don't know if I'll get through all three next stream because it's three hours into this stream and I've only done two sets. Nearly three hours I mean. I'll probably finish at the three hour mark. beautiful colors I know they'll all get covered up as eventually but right now this thing looks so beautiful you started part two at 150 one hour 56 one hour about then yeah okay that makes sense so yeah it was definitely much shorter than the first one then again the first one I was also fucking around a lot more and I wasn't in the zone now I'm much more in the zone I love the little snaps when you snap something into place. It's so perfect. Finally, some grapes. Oh, the grape is so oh, smart. We used two grapes per. What the fuck? Where'd it go? There we go. I feel like it just flew out of my hands. is one set done. Well, one of these four that I need to make, so let's do that three more times. Let's go. I think that's the most annoying thing, is having to do this multiple times, but at the same time, it's, you know, it's the whole reason we do it. It's just to build stuff. And listen to music. I've, I've, I've turned up the music a little bit for, uh, for myself, so. Malone, donate one bit, you'll be number one bit donor. Oh my god. For a short while, Birdie and Ellie were fighting for number one gift person. I think, yeah, Birdie's winning right now. Oh, let's go, Pog. Malone, thank you for the bit. Much appreciated, bro. Congrats on your new role as the number one bit donator. Now to just uh, now to just get more people to fight for it. Now I make all the money and I become rich. That's how that works, right? <laughs> like and a black one there. It's what happens on Bishop. It's what happened on Bishop stream. I didn't even know that. That's awesome. Glad to hear it for him. That's awesome. Dude deserves some uh, support. Like he's a fucking incredible creator, content creator. These, all these little guys. We're getting so close to being done with all the pieces. I can't believe it. I moved with such diligence on this one. It's incredible. I'm so pog champ. by ones as they're officially named I'm sure uh, the same part is always a lot less than part one part one is always the biggest I didn't know that oh, it's a million I win now <laughs> so I'm doing myself valid I think till 6k bets holy shit dude that's incredible oh fucking hell I okay saved it nothing went off the table I thought I thought something would go flying off uh, somehow I nothing did. Proud of myself.
Two by one stud, yeah. That's it. Stud as opposed to a snot. Let's put these along here. I didn't know part two is always less than part one, but uh, I appreciate it because I need a, I need, I need to be done. My back's starting to hurt. I'm like an old person, and uh, I want to go go relax. This has been a bit of a long stream, which is fun for sure, but I definitely can't go for like four hours. I also want to check what I missed on my phone. A lot of the time I have a bad habit of checking my phone in the middle of stream, uh, so thankfully using it as a camera stops that, <laughs> but it also means I just lost all my notifications probably, so I'm going to have to figure out everything I missed by physically going through every app and checking. That'll be fun. That'll be a fun little couple hours. Probably not that long, but I get to watch YouTube now. Yay. Dude, I've been chilling so much this weekend because I've had four hours of, uh, four, four hours, four days of free time. Old, old, old Mandatory Wilson. Old Rat Simper. I'm not a Rat Simp. I swear, I'm the Rat King. All right. Let's see what we do with uh, with these things now. So we're gonna bring all them over here. Then we're gonna do. Oh, interesting. Oh, that's, that's cool. It fits in so satisfyingly. Look at that. Hell yeah. That's awesome. It's so cool because you do you do this first part and and you're like, okay, cool, I gotta do that so many more times, and then you just do the next three one right after another. So it, instead of spending time doing that a billion times, they make it easier for you to do it all at once. That's awesome, dude. I love that. Uh, now for the final few things. Okay. You need two of these and two of these. That makes sense. And oh, this is literally the final thing. Oh boy, I'm sad. I'm sad, it's already over. Uh, there we go. Boom, 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 and boom. That's it! That's it! That's... That is part two done. Makes you wonder why they don't make four on each side at once. Well, I think they just want you to spend more time on it so you do the first one. So remember when you played a rat dating simulator? I was helping another rat get a rat girlfriend. That's how it works. But yeah, look at that, man. That looks great. I love this. That's awesome. So we'll get to Lady Liberty soon. Soon enough. But, um... For now, that's all. I'm gonna find someone to raid. I don't know if someone's gonna be around who is rateable because i feel like i started this very early and it's a monday but it is also vacation so i wouldn't oh yep no one's no one's live huh well should i just search up lego let's see if someone else is making a lego stream like doing a lego thing oh no no! No one's doing Lego! Okay, do you guys have anyone that you'd like me to raid? Because I... I see no one, which sucks. Hit me with any names. One of you, any of you can... can... push the raid. Whoever you want me to raid. I know some, but they don't fit in your audience. Uh, don't fit how? Like, are they, are, are they not vulgar at all or something? Different games? It's cool. I mean... Ah, uh, alright. Well, in that case, I'll just raid this big guy who... Already has a, a fucking thousand of uh, of people, but try Lcon twenty one. All right, sure. 
Uh, Trackmania. Sure, we can do that. I'm sure the dude will appreciate it. Alright. Cool, well, I should say real quick, I mean, uh, thank you guys for watching, thank you guys for all the support. Um, this stream has been awesome. I've had a lot of fun, and um, I will definitely be back to finish this guy off incredibly soon. I'll try not to break him in the meantime, but uh, thank you guys for all the support today. Uh, I, I, I very much appreciate it. Um, and yeah, I mean, I guess that's it. Have Enjoy the Trackmania stream. Have a good one, guys.